Hey cool friends, I'm Bianca Renee and you're watching Bianca Renee Today. And today I have created a budget-friendly curly hair routine. I'm gonna do an entire wash and go with $20. And I took a little risk because I'm using three products that I've never tried before. Now today's video is sponsored by Sally Beauty, but Sally Beauty always lets me choose whatever products I want to review and try out. So today, I grabbed the Myel Organics Rosemary Mint Strengthening Shampoo, infused with biotin and encourages growth. The main reason why I chose this one, <laughs> got some little, uh, you know, postpartum little bangs going on. That's not baby hair, that's baby breakage. <laughs> so I've seen like the oil go viral, which I do have, which I wanna really start trying. Um, to really encourage growth in that area specifically. But hey, who wouldn't mind having longer hair in general, including biotin on the scalp, on the hair? Sounds like a good idea. This was my biggest splurge, if you will, of being $10.99, still not bad. Then I got this new Earth Supply Textured Hair Care Silicone Free Rinse Out Conditioner. Literally have never heard of this brand before, but I like that it said no sulfates, no silicones, no paraben, no mineral oil, it has 5% shea butter, and it was only $6.59. That's 13 fluid ounces, so it's a pretty good sized bottle. Why not? And for my styler, I grabbed the African Pride Moisture Miracle Flaxseed Oil and Shea Butter Curl Defining Gel in Cream. I'm always really intrigued by gel cream combos, so I really wanted to try this one. This was my cheapest one, coming out to only $5.99. Winning. So if you are a mathematician, you might be like, um, that does not equal $20. Well, Sally Beauty had a sale, where if you spend at least $20, you get $5 back. So these were $10. $20.33. Okay, I went 33 cents over the budget. If you just don't get the guacamole next time you go to Chipotle, you're fine. So spoiler alert, that is how I got to this look right here. But let me take it back to the shower where I tried these products for the first time. Starting off with the Myel Rosemary Mint Strengthening Shampoo. It is infused with biotin and encourages growth. It's a strengthening shampoo that's supposed to instantly nourish and cleanse dry, weak, and brittle hair with the scalp tingling strengthening shampoo. You do instantly smell that like minty scent. So I don't mind the tingly feeling on my scalp. It kind of lets me know that it's working. It says to apply a dime sized amount. Whoops, you know, we never do that part. Uh, then you massage on your hair for a nice rich lather, rinse it out. And yeah, I liked it. I like a shampoo that suds and I'm always down to sneak in some biotin when I can. Now let's try this new earth supplied silicone free rinse out conditioner. I like that you're getting 13 ounces for only like $6. To be honest, I had very low expectations because I've never heard of this brand. It was like super affordable, but I was pleasantly surprised at the amount of slip this had. My hair really felt moisturized after using this. It says to apply it and then leave it on for five minutes and then rinse it out. So you kind of use it as like a little mini deep conditioner, if you will, but it's claiming to be formulated with 5% African shea butter to replenish moisture, detangling, soften, and repair coily and curly hair. And I think it did just that. It adds slip to my hair, which helps prevent breakage, infuses moisture, and shine. So for a really affordable brand that I've never heard of before that doesn't even have any silicone in, I was very happy with the slip and the moisture once my hair was done. Then once I got out of the shower, it's time to try the one that I'm probably most excited for, which is the African Pride Moisture Miracle Flax Seed and Shea Butter Curl Defining Gel and Cream. This is a three-in-one curl training system that's supposed to define curl pattern, mold, and hold shape hydrates and adds shine. It's also claiming to define and elongate natural coil and curl patterns. So you definitely smell the shea butter in this. The consistency is actually thicker than I thought it would be for being a cream gel. I thought it'd be a little bit more slippery, but it has some thickness to it, but not too thick to where it's gonna be overbearing for my fine and low porosity hair. So I applied a decent amount on both sides, smoothing it in, scrunching it up, and just from the look of it, I could tell it was very promising. After applying the gel and cream, my hair looked really good. It was very promising. So I let it air dry for a little bit, finished my makeup. Then to diffuse, I grabbed the Ion Luxe Supercharged Blow Dryer and Diffuser to give my hair some more volume and dry a little bit faster. And voila, that is how I got to this point here. I did let it air dry for majority of the day because I had to run out the house. And then I came back to do a little diffusing for some more volume. 
but my hair looks really shiny. The curls are defined. I was really happy with the amount of hold. I was wondering if this had any like polyquats in here because it did have a really good hold just from air drying, but it has no polyquats, but it does have flaxseed oil. And flaxseed says provides natural hold and restores shine. So if you aren't a strong hold gal and you're not a soft hold gal, you're kind of like a medium hold, this is going to be a perfect product for you because you're getting the cream part, which will give you the moisture, and you're getting the hold from the flaxseed. So it's like a perfect combo of both, and it's only $5.99. That's before the sale. And then my curls are looking really shiny, probably because of the shea butter in the styler, and there's also shea butter in my conditioner. So I kind of got some double shea going on. It's really important for my styler to start off with some type of cast, whether it's medium or strong hold. I need some type of something. And once I scrunched it out and diffused, I still have a little bit of that hold on like the outer layer, which is gonna keep the curls looking luscious longer. And then it's a little bit softer on the inside, which I think is totally fine, but we did it! A $20 hair routine. I love being able to give you guys options. Yes, I know a lot of my favorite products are kind of pricey half the time, but that's not the only way to get beautiful curls. There's plenty of affordable options out there, and Sally Beauty has a big range from $5 products to maybe $18 products. It's all about trying new things and figuring out what works for you and your curls. So yes, I probably could have done like an all my L routine or an all earth supplied routine or an all African pride routine, but I really was just curious and wanted to try these specifically. And these were the products out of the lines that were sulfate, paraben, and silicone free. If that's not a big deal for you, you might have a couple more options from these lines than I would use. But overall, I'm happy with it and I will continue to use these products. I'm probably gonna really wanna use this one because I want my hair to grow, especially my edges. I'm probably gonna try the Myel Oil, which is also available at Sally Beauty. This was a really good conditioner. I probably also use this on my son because I need a lot of conditioner for all those little curls he's got. And I will definitely continue to use this. I'll probably even use this one more on my refresh days because sometimes I want more moisture because your hair is kind of drying out throughout the week, but I also want that hold back. So having a gel and cream combo it's just perfect. It's a one and done styler. I use this on its own. So not only are you saving money because this brand has really affordable products that are like $5.99, you're also kind of getting two products for the price of one instead of purchasing a cream styler and a gel styler. And since the conditioner is a rinse out, but it says to sit back, relax, and let the shea butter do its work, rinse after five minutes, you're almost kind of getting like a deep conditioner vibe just from this conditioner alone. But a whole routine for 20 bucks, some of my favorite products are $20 for one product. So this is a great way to save some money and still get beautiful curls. I got a lot of mixed comments on my last Sally Beauty haul about doing like an affordable routine with some new products or trying the Gabrielle Union Flawless line. I think I'm gonna try that next. I got a lot of requests to do that. So let me let me play with it first and then get back to you. But definitely check out Sally Beauty whether you're watching this video in current time or down the road because they're always having a sale. If you enjoyed this affordable curly hair routine, make sure to give me a thumbs up and subscribe. I post new videos every week. You also can follow me on Instagram, TikTok, and Twitter at Ms. Bianca Renee. I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching Bianca Renee today. Yeah.